Okay, we had a big change of plans. Pretty which, large. Well, I mean, I kind of was like, that's probably what we're going to do yesterday when we were filming. But now it's officially what we're going to do. Yeah, oh, I knew I knew the deal. I know how this stuff goes. This is our Dell engine. Our big 465 cubic inch SB2. Right. It is going in Foghorn, the original Longhorn that we bought. The one we ran at Jackson last week and the one that we just pulled the drain out of. Where'd it go? It's back there somewhere in the corner. But the drain came out of here last night, yesterday rather. And now we're switching gears and putting the Dell engine right in the hole it was in. Down a little bit more. Down a little, down little more. A little bit more, yeah. Coming down. Yeah, we're clear now. Throw it up. Oh. Ooh. Man, I ain't never had one slide in that easy. <laughs> you go right in? Yeah. Like it was meant to be in there. Dale's getting ready. The drain jumped right out. Yeah, the drain just right out. And this one's right I'm in. Done. <laughs> Dale said, I, I got you, dog. Give me a whole bag on it. Okay, got it. You got it? Yeah. So we have been planning on plan A for the week was to go to Why Not Motorsports Park Saturday night, debut the new car with our fresh Jay Dickens racing engine. Pretty much what it comes down to is we uh, we've run out of time and we're missing waiting, still waiting on a few parts that are most likely not going to make it this week. So we're switching gears, not only going to race this car and the Dell engine, but also going to try to make it to Buckshot. Friday night to race with the Schaefer's Oil Series uh, in Alabama. And it, hey, just so y'all know, it is currently in Milton, Florida, Thursday at 2.30 in the afternoon. And we need to be, so we need to be gone from here in 22 hours-ish, something like that. Yeah. Yeah. So, you know, kind of last minute, but that's how we roll. Meanwhile, you getting it? Oh, yeah. Oh yeah. We gotta run a different tire at the two tracks. So Saturday will be Why Not Motorsports Park with the Mississippi State Series. We'll be on the same tire rule there as we were last week at Jackson. Tomorrow night though, Friday night at Buckshot, I guess we're gonna be on 21s, crate tires. That's the plan. Yeah, Ed, gonna run some of Jesse's tires. He wasn't up there banging that cush so he didn't hurt them tires. <laughs> Hey, he's still a little sore about that, the way those events went. This one here? Oh, the one to go into the front? Yeah. Yeah. yeah that's got to come over here, right? Yeah. That's got to go over here. So if y'all saw in our last video where we pulled a drain out and Jesse gave the tutorial on the oil lines, the inlet, the oil going in line over here on this engine is there. So... We had it running way around here. We don't need this line. We're going to need a shorter line. Okay, we can just tie up the excess. Yeah. Probably wrap it around the carburetor and back down. Again. Exactly. That going to fit? We're kind of worried about this. This will work just fine. The right side, we can't really tell until we get the uh, door bar. Oops. Back on. So we have not, we are yet to run the Dell engine in a Longhorn. So we were a little worried the drain headers fit just fine same headers that we were running in faithful in the capitals whenever we ran the drain they fit just fine so we're hoping these headers the sb2 headers fit just fine on the dell engine in the longhorn here i got this in i'm gonna put this with the drain motor how's that sound for now i mean unless you got a better place to put it there's where she goes in on the drain We'll leave that there for now. So this engine, this will be the first time we've run this engine this year. Jet, last time we ran it, Jesse ran at Alltech. Yeah. Then Betty, last time we ran the Dell engine. We got the Dell engine used right ahead of Bristol just mm -hmm. over a year ago. 465 cubic inch SB2 engine that's quite a bit of power you're gonna have plenty of power for buckshot yeah <laughs> it's mild for what it is i'll tell you right but it's it, it, it's just really good and usable that's the you know we've run this thing you know a handful of different spots jesse run it at buckshot yeah 
just one of those motors you uh versatile yeah it's got a bunch of inches to it but it you, but it ain't like it just it's not erratic or nothing it just it's a pretty smooth little motor you know so good job well buckshot's kind of tight small why not you can use a lot of motor there even though it's a small track typically mm -hmm. but it'd be what we got either way Got our oil line. Yes. So you don't want to put one of them restrictors in there? I didn't hear you. <laughs> so y'all heard us talking about this in the last video when we pulled this carburetor off the drain. This is this carburetor came with this engine. We have yet to run it on this engine, however. You done? Yeah, we'll make what something work. Oh. Looking sharp, to, fellas. I was trying not to put all my brakes. weight on that. It's, it's got, got the pedal brake. Yeah, pedal brake, old fashioned like. Yeah. What? You never had a bike with pedal brake? Old fashioned like. So these are being given away at Alltech? Yes. Two dozen bikes? That's 24? what they're trying to get. I think we got about 10 or 11 after, well, no, probably up to about 12, halfway there. Okay. We're donating bikes to give away to kids. All right, so that's next week, Easter weekend. They're doing an Easter, Easter egg hunt. Easter Bunny's going to be there. It's going to be an Easter egg hunt. They're going to have bounce houses for the kids. And giving away two dozen away. bicycles to I the think, kids. Uh, every feature starter, I don't know, I think they're going to give an egg to a kid. And, 24 of them are going to have bikes or something like, you know, yeah. ticket you want to buy or something. Anyway, we're donating these three. If any of you, anyone watching is interested in donating a bike uh, or contributing to the fund for the bikes, let us know. We'll leave an email in the description where you can get into so that event and this event we're going to Saturday night. Why not? That's why not this week. All Tech next week will both be on HuntTheFront.tv. By the way, we're giving away these three doors to anyone that has a subscription to hunt the front tv during the month of april would be a perfect time to subscribe and watch us at why not this week all tech next week rome georgia april 15th and then deep south speedway at the end of the month april 28th and 29th all live on huntthefront.tv did you add a uh, an extra accelerator spring I actually took some off i'm ready to let it eat <laughs> okay all right, we got the spark plugs pulled out. We're gonna put new ones in. We're gonna spin it over, get some old pressure out of this thing. You're in low gear, or a gear of some sort. Okay. Okay. 60 LBs. Well, that's good. You know how we know they're new? Brand new, Dale. <laughs> it's approved by Dale. In case you were wondering, it's 35. 35, yeah. Mm -hmm. That's what I thought. I ain't gonna race, boy. You ain't talk really about me racing, but like, if you think it's possible, sure. I ain't gonna do it. I ain't, gonna do it. <laughs> I ain't got tired. Well, I ain't got wheels. Well, we didn't until what we thought about it, and then they're on 1350s, and that just worked out. We got them. What, are you going to get to work on it or what? I'm going to pick at it, you know, as long as they make sure they got this. Make sure this thing cranks first. I got off. his tires pretty much ready. Got a groove on for Saturday, but for Friday, he's about ready. So they're running 604s at both Buckshot Friday night and at Why Not. So, yeah, but. But. Yeah, I haven't thought this far ahead. So I can run 1350s at Buckshot, but I won't be able to run 1350s at Why Not. You got to have 21s. Which, if you can talk Joseph into oh, taking it easy, his, you could have his. Flip them over. Flip them and run them. That's, that's the plan. Maybe take a right rear. You need to take a couple of tires Memories. off the wheel. Yeah. What? You need to take a couple of tires. Yeah, off the wheel. So what you're telling me is if this thing fires off and does what it's this supposed to, we might... I might start... Start getting it. Right there, right there. I missed. Here we go.
gonna be able to straighten that? That might be rare. <laughs> put this one on. Oh, it's yeah. got a little touch mark on it. So you tell me this spoiler side made it one race. Yeah. We gave Jesse a brand new spoiler side. You got lucky that that's all that happened. So this happened on the last lap at Jackson. The leader broke. Jesse caught him. I guess caught him with the spoiler, huh? I barely got him. Barely nicked him. It broke a bracing under there and ruined a brand new side. It ruined it. Ruined it. But, dude, but. it, it could have knocked the whole back head. It could have been a lot worse. It could have been terrible. could have been a lot worse. Anyway, that one sounds good. It does. Old Dale. Old Dale. I think we'll be in good shape there. Might as well put this one together and take it too. Mm-hmm. What about your roof? It's still got... It's got some fall to it. It's about the wrong way for downfall. It ain't leaving the shot looking like that. I really just let it sit in the sun and it kind of popped itself I, back right here. I bet if we put some heat on it, it would we could get probably it really. reformed. But that'll do. It'll probably look worse than that when he gets done with it. Hey, why not for sure? Yeah. Anyway, this is the same. This is the same deck piece that was all wadded up at Jackson Saturday night, and same quarter panel. Yeah, not bad. Why well, buy new when you can use use used? Yes. Used, used. Right. Come on, come on, come on, come on. I go. Oh yeah, yeah. Oh yeah, that was a. Uh, it got damaged in shipping. Yeah. So we got it for like Real, next to nothing. Three? Yeah. Oh. That's some of that free fitty. <laughs> well, it looks much better than it did. I'll tell you that. <laughs> what y'all think? Look good to y'all. Much better. Worth the time and effort. Good job, Joe. Good job, Joe. You too, Jesse. All right, I need my neck built now. <laughs> hey, y'all hungry? Hey, I got dinner. Y'all were worried I forgot about you, weren't you? Yeah, I think that took a little while. It was, it was rush time. I thought for sure y'all would have these things loaded. Okay, so big thank you to Guestford Elevators and Lifts for lunch all week. No doubt. <laughs> thank you. Shane at Guestford said he wanted to sponsor us a week of lunch. He figures it'd be Whataburger. That seems to be what we like. It just, it's Whataburger is what's close and we like Whataburger anyway thank you to Shane and everyone at Guestford Elevator and Lifts for lunch actually I guess that'd be dinner they would give me half of one nah <laughs> you gonna shine yours up yeah. oh hey he's probably all hey right. they all shine out front right that's right <laughs> I don't know if you're going to make it. Really? <laughs> oh. There you go. Just push your way. Plow on through there, Jesse. Easy. Easy. Ease her down. That's the group races. Oh, yeah. Probably not the group race. Saturday night is not. Come on. All right. Yeah, tape measure. Oh yeah, we got an inch. So we had to lower it for the deck height. Yeah. Whoa. We got an out. Heck, we got hold on up a little more. Fifty-eight. Yeah, you got a half yeah, inch to spare. All right. Perfect. Hey, we gotta remember to lower that back down for Saturday. Why not? Yeah, they'll let us know. That's right. Okay, there's one on the ground. And there's the second one on the ground. Hold on, let's see. It is 8.29 p.m. 
What time did we make our mind up to go to Buckshot? It was 2.30. 2.30 early? I think it was about 2.00. 8.30. You also got to think about what time did we decide, hey. But is it right, we're going to change plans. Yeah, changing everything. Yeah. 2.30 Yeah. So not bad. No, yeah, not bad at all. We went from going racing Saturday night with one car to racing two on Friday. Yeah, it was like a 6.30 kind of deal. On, the... <laughs> <laughs> on racing two. Uh, I start walking your way. You start walking mine. Yeah, but I have gas <laughs> oh, oh, is that the forklift? That was a forklift. <laughs> you weren't rolling drums over, were you? No. <laughs> it works a lot better, but we need more tread. It needs a little more tread on it. You got our steering buddy in there? We got our steering. Ready to roll? Friend. Our steering pal? Yeah. Yeah, you good over here on my side? Plenty of room on the right foot. Beautiful. All right. I want nothing to it. I do think I like the matte black better than the gloss. Yeah, it looks pretty good. You know what? On this wrap. <laughs> Wookie doggy. Every time. <laughs> I'll strap the front. Easy, easy, easy. Listen, <laughs> ideally you don't tear this car up this weekend, Joseph. Yeah. We wash it, put it in the shop. Right back in there. gear in it. And work on the new car. Right. right. You know the reality of it, Jesse? What? This car needs, we'll have about three days worth of work needs to be done to it. And that one got two to three left to be done to it. And then we're just as late and just as tired leaving the road also. Watch that quarter panel. Come on, push it. Push. Are we hitting another car? Yeah, you're Oh, right oh, oh, stop. That's good. Don't bump his car. Wrap it down, Jordy. 604, Betty up front. Foghorn with the Dell engine in the back going to Buckshot. That race will have happened by the time y'all are seeing this, but Saturday night we'll be at Why Not, and that will be live on HuntTheFront.tv. So if you're watching this Saturday, get over the hunt, HuntTheFront.tv, watch us live Saturday night at Why Not. Wish we could have been debuting the new car this weekend, but we'll do that next week, April 7th and 8th at All Tech raceway with the debut of the hunt the front super series that event will also be live on hunt the thank you for watching this video like comment subscribe we will see y'all later